Hey guys, welcome back to Zach Blood. So, a friend of mine wants me to build him a useless box. So, that's what we're going to look at today. I'm sure we've all heard of the useless box. Uh, you can build them with just logic gates and stuff, or normal, actually not even logic gates, just switches and stuff like that. Or you can use an Arduino. Uh, pricing things out, it's cheaper to make it for him with an Arduino. But, uh... We all know what the useless box is, so let's go. That was really fun. I love these things. I'm probably gonna print out another one for myself. There's really not much to say about it. Um, the servo is wired up to pin 9, the switch is wired up to pin 2. Uh, it's an input pull up in the code for the switch, and you just gotta tinker a little bit with the values uh, for where to send the servo, and that's really it. I'll put a link to the code in the description. I changed it a little bit. Um, the way my servo's set up and everything, yours will be changed a little bit differently. So I'll just put a link to the original code in the description, not to the code that I've edited. I haven't really edited much other than the value for the um, servo. Uh, I guess I also kind of tampered with the timing a little bit. I found it was really slow. Basically, everything for timing I turned down to 1. So, as usual, all the YouTube stuff. Uh, hit the thumbs up if you liked it. Hit the thumbs down if you disliked it. Uh, leave a comment down there for me. Hit the subscribe button for more. And I'll put a card up here for the Patreon account if you ever feel like sending a couple bucks a month my way. Uh, it helps out with filament, um, Arduinos to keep on hand. It just generally, it all goes toward the channel, so... If you feel like helping out, there's that. So, anyway, have a good one, guys.